You didn't notice anything when you were driving in. Yeah. The chemical plant. It's called Petrotrin. It's got oil and gas. It's an oil and gas company. Okay, and do you think it's very weird that we are located in the middle of an oil refinery? And we are located in the middle of an oil refinery. And we are showing by example that you can have both nature and the industry surviving simultaneously. You do not need to sacrifice one for the other. For as long as we can recall, the negative impacts of industrial activity have been detrimental to nature. Top executive managers have often been held responsible for damaging business practices like strip mining and slash and burn farming techniques. These stereotypes have influenced common perspectives due to years of contradicting views and perceptions. But what if there is a solution to this rivalry? What if you were introduced to this hybrid concept that could revolutionize and harmonize the relations between profitable industries and environmental organizations? Welcome to the Pointe Pierre Wild Fowl Trust. Established in 1966 as an independent non-profit environmental organization, both the Trust and Petrochin have illustrated that two conflicting industries can work together to preserve local biodiversity and natural habitats. Focusing on the protection of a habitat that is home for such an array of birds, the Trust contains two lakes and 25 hectares of land located in the middle of an oil refinery. By working in collaboration, both Petrochin and the Trust have combined efforts to keep, breed, and later release a multitude of endangered species. The Trust also pays special attention to its ecosystem and raises awareness to the remedies that can be practiced by learning how to use the natural elements of nature. Today, there are 86 species of birds recorded in the Pointe Pierre Wildfowl Trust. decided to be supportive of this whole effort to make sure that we have probably the only sort of wildfowl trust within a refinery compound maybe in the world. You know? um, I also live on one of these lakes and I was just telling Molly that I have two dogs and um, one of the dogs rides the caiman's back sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> so she was just warning me that the, the, the dogs are on the Cayman's food chain. <laughs> but, but sometimes, just as harmony has developed between industry and environment, apparently some degree of harmony has developed between reptile and, and domestic, domestic environment. <laughs> so, you know, I think that we can continue to demonstrate the harmony once more between industry, industrial development, commerce, um, progress, and respect for you know, God-given um, creatures and the, and the like. Well, trouble melts like lemon drops High above the chimney top That's where you find me Oh, somewhere over the rainbow Bluebirds fly You can experience live discover I like the dark and visit the Pointe Pierre Wildfowl Trust. Visit the beautiful island of Trinidad and Tobago. Duck.